Now, after reporting a COVID outbreak for the first time since the start of the pandemic, experts have said that North Korea could soon be faced with a COVID-19 catastrophe. A total of 56 deaths and nearly 1.5 million cases of fever have been reported in North Korea since the country announced its first COVID case a week ago. The United Nations has also voiced alarm at the swelling COVID outbreak in the country. The World Health Organization warned that the country's unvaccinated population was particularly vulnerable, adding that transmission among unvaccinated people created a higher risk of new variants. They also offered to provide assistance and vaccination to the country. The UN Rights Office warned that the measures taken by authorities risked pushing vulnerable people into an even more precarious situation. Now, as the situation in the country continues to worsen, it remains to be seen how leader Kim Jong-un deals with the outbreak. Democratic People's Republic of Korea, DPRK, has announced through their state media their first outbreak of COVID-19 with more than 1.4 million suspected cases since late April. WHO is deeply concerned at the risk of further spread of COVID-19 in the country, particularly because the population is unvaccinated. Now, the isolated country continues to refer to the virus as fever. On Tuesday, North Korea reported another massive rise in new cases. The country recorded close to 270,000 additional cases and six more deaths. And according to official data, nearly 64,000 people were in quarantine. However, the actual outbreak is likely to be greater than the official tally due to lack of tests and resources to monitor the situation. Leader Kim Jong-un has ordered nationwide lockdowns to try to slow the spread of the disease and deployed the military after what he, he has called a botched response to the outbreak. North Korea has one of the world's worst health care systems with poorly equipped hospitals, few intensive care units and no COVID treatment drugs or mass testing ability. According to experts, and to make matters worse, North Korea is yet to even vaccinate its population. They also do not have access to international vaccines to combat the virus. Moreover, the country's economy has already been hammered by natural disasters. International sanctions imposed due to missile testing and COVID-enforced border closure with its main trading partner, China.